the heart of our pastors to raise up our youth in the word, in the ways of the Lord. And so this morning we have the privilege of hearing from one of our blazers. Please welcome Alyssa. something or someone that really bothers us. We can't always control situations that come our way. We aren't responsible for how others act, but we are able to control our own responses. The scripture that reminds me of this is Proverbs 16, 7. I'm going to read it to you from the message translation. I chose this translation because the verse helped me understand it more. When God approves of your life, even your enemies will end up shaking your hand. Have you ever watched a TV show or movie when someone wanted to get revenge? Mm -hmm. Getting revenge isn't exactly what pleases God. Romans 12, 19 says, Dear friends, never take revenge. Leave that to the righteous anger of God. For the scriptures say, I will take revenge. I will pay them back, says the Lord. What about in real life, at school, or at work? What helps me is Proverbs 16, 7. When God approves of my life, even my enemies will end up shaking my hand. This is how I am learning to handle difficult situations. Now let us bow our heads in prayer. Dear Lord, I ask that you help us to handle difficult situations by applying your word. Help us to remember that we must first please you in the way that we respond to difficult situations. When we do that, your promise is to make our enemies be at peace with us, and you always keep your promises. In Jesus' name, amen. 